Greetings, wonderful people of YouTube. I have returned, and this is my consumer's report on the Wolf Four Slice Toaster. So I'm sure that if you've looked at buying this thing, you've already looked online, you've kind of read what the stats are, uh, you know that it's really solid. It feels like it weighs like... No. Oh, it's pretty damn heavy. Uh, it could weigh anywhere from three to five pounds. I'm not going to actually weigh it to let you know. Uh, it's pretty simplistic in the features. You have your knobs, which basically indicate your toasting doneness levels. You have your uh, you have your bagel, which will just do the insides and leave the outsides frozen, which will give it a little extra time and keep warm. Uh, the key to using these things, though, is to engage them before you actually uh, put your toast down, because if you don't engage them or you engage them whilst your toast is toasting, uh, it will still just pop up. Uh, so it basically it doesn't work well that way. So. Uh, the big problem I had with toasters before I settled in on this one was the fact that a single slice toaster uh, does toast for crap. You basically uh, have a lot of um, uneven toasting. So I've got here my uh, my my used old bread. It's not as it's it's still soft, you can see, but it's not like as mushy soft as you'll get from new uh, from new toast. So I'm going to show you the capability of it uh, toasting on a single slice toaster. So. Basically, I'll just put those guys in, put this in here. Um, one thing that I was a little concerned about when I first got this toaster was when I popped the toast down and I looked at the, the grills, uh, not all of them were glowing. And I was like, oh no, this is going to be another crappy toaster. Um, however, there was actually a disclaimer stated that the uh, in the box that Wolf Toasters based uh, toast their heating on radiant heat and therefore uh, not all of the uh, elements need to glow for it to toast. So I'm just going to keep it down to four and a half, give or take. Uh, everybody's toaster is going to be a little bit different depending on you are, temperature, house, bread, etc. Um, so you push it down, you hold it for a few seconds. Uh, this, it kind of does center the toast nicely. So if you look, you'll see that it's kind of holds it right in there. All right. So uh, I'm going to put a pause on this while the, actually, no, maybe I'll get a chance to see if it's not too I'll just wait for the elements to heat up and uh, I'll put a pause on it and then I'll show you which elements uh, were and were not glowing. So, okay, so the elements have heated up a little bit and I don't want to burn out my phone. So you notice that the right hand side of the elements seem to be glowing a lot more on the right hand side of the toaster. There are some glowing down there, but also the bright light kind of makes it harder to see. Uh, on the On the center part of the toaster, the inside grill seems to be lit more. The outside one mostly just shows towards the edges and there's a few down below and a few others. Um, and for this one, you can see that it's glowing pretty intensely there, a little less there, uh, pretty intensely on that side, a little less on that side. So the big question is, how is this toast going to toast? So again, I'll put it on pause so I don't have to, you don't have to endure the duration and uh, we'll continue in a minute or two. Okay, so four and a half, almost five, is a little too much for the toast, so I'm gonna... <laughs> Alright, and I'll hit cancel on this one. So, basically, what I like about this as well is that it beeps to let you know that your uh, that your toast is done. So, you know, the times where you throw your toast down and you forget that it's there. Uh, so I turned it up a little bit high, just so you get an idea of how it actually toasts on either side and it's more easily to the camera. So, yeah, this is more incinerated than I'd like. But it does go to show you that, surprisingly, it really toasts well for a single slice toaster, which is exactly what we were looking for. Um, so now, how does she work on a four slice? Now the toaster's kind of heated up, so I'm going to assume that it's probably a little bit, um, it's going to be a little bit quicker to toast. So for the four slices, thank God for stale bread. My husband would never let me do this test otherwise. And of course, this slice is a little on the off side. So we'll uh, push her down. Got to hold it for a few seconds. Again, hold it for a few seconds. And uh, we'll pause the video. Actually, I'll bring the temperatures down to just under four. I'll pause the video. And uh, then when the toast is about ready to pop up, I will show you the toasting capability. Okay. So as if you're staring at the toast and it pops up, scared the crap out of me, to be honest with you. Um, okay, so here it is. Um, it was just at uh, the, the knob before. So from the toast from the left-hand side, uh, 
not 100% even kind of toasting in that respect. But the bottom line is both sides are toasted and I'm pretty happy with that. Um, we've had quite a bit of difficulties with really strange um, balances for toasting. A little bit more on the darker side. And now that being said is moisture, uh, toast with a lot moisture, more content will probably toast faster. Toast with a more higher sugar amount like the Dempsters, which the bread tends to be a little bit on the sweeter side. That stuff is going to toast a little bit harder too. We've uh, done our homemade artisan bread in here. Uh, it's wonderful. And uh, also, just as you might notice, that uh, we did invest in a um, APC to prevent any power surges considering the uh, expense of these two items. Disclaimer being, uh, I'm very happy with the way mine works. Uh, I can't attest to all of the, uh, the Wolf products, but uh, I would recommend this to a friend if they have a, a lot of spare cash to burn. Uh, it's a nice looking toaster. It's very solid. And I anticipate it lasting for, for a great many years. And uh, my husband and I are very happy with the, the way it toasts. So I'm not going to say, hey, go out and buy this. I would recommend it to a friend, like I said, if they have the cash to burn. Um, but like anything, do your own research. Don't just rely on, on my video here. But I kind of thought people might appreciate seeing it actually in action. So thank you very much for your time and have a great day.